The Ashanti Regional Minister Simon Asemensa and Member of Parliament for Nshayeso Constituency Kennedy Kankam were in the area to inspect the road for construction to commence. They took the time to engage squatters who have taken advantage of the bad roads to make homes and businesses along the road. They notified the squatters to relocate and pave way for the contractor who is moving to site soon. The two were clear that nothing should hinder the construction of the road. This is highly congested. You can see a lot of pure, a lot of opinion, too many traders. And we don't want to take anybody by surprise. So we are advising them those that will be affected to start moving their assets. The planning part, the last time I interacted with the contractors and the engineers from the Federal Roads and Urban Roads, that the whole engineering is going to be changed. They are going to do this, right? they are going to do new drains and other things so that when it rains, it will reduce that flooding drastically. So I think when we are able to finish this project, it's going to be a big relief on the people that live on the eastern part of the country. It is hoped the construction will avert major flooding in the area and also ensure smooth flow of traffic. Squatters appreciated the MP's notice and promised to relocate in the shortest possible time to make way for the construction. At present, business activities, according to the squatters, have stalled badly due to the terrible nature of the road and they appealed to the contractor to stick to the timeline. <laughs>